Okay, I'd like to explain to you now how the transformer and your battery system works through the van for your 12 volt. Most of your van is 12 volt. All your lighting, pressure pump, and other gauges are all 12 volt through the van. The monitor in the Sterling shows your water tank level and your battery condition. Okay, the battery switch up here operates is a battery isolating switch. You have that switch on when you're using the van and off when you're storing the van. Okay, with the transformer, there's also fuses here in the front. And they're just 12 volt fuses, which are marked for your lights, um, pump, radio, and battery. By using your lights, pressure pump, TV, and radio moderately, you should get approximately three to four days from your battery. The battery in this van is located under the bed. The battery location can vary from model to model. Okay. When you get to a caravan park, by lifting up the flap and plugging in your 15 amp cord, you can now operate your air conditioner, microwave, and all your power points through the van. After your holiday, when you get home and you're going to store the van, after a three month period, if you haven't used the van in that time, you need to switch the battery switch on, plug your power in, leave it for 48 hours, give the battery a good charge, then shut it down. If another three months goes by, just keep doing the same thing but hopefully you'll use the van more often than that.